Hi, I'm David Glickman. I'm the founder and CEO of Ultra Mobile and Univision Mobile. Here we go. Ultra Mobile is a, an MVNO in the US. We launched about four years ago. Uh, we grew very quickly. We're probably one of the most successful MVNO launches in the United States in the last five years. Uh, currently, uh, we've been growing so quickly that we became number one on the Inc. 5000, and we're officially the fastest growing company in America. Several months ago, uh, we purchased Univision Mobile. Uh, Univision Mobile is focused on uh, the Latin American and Hispanic customer in the United States. And since we focus on all ethnic, uh, all ethnicities in the United States, uh, it's, a, it's a natural, uh, it was a natural purchase for us. And uh, it, it's been seamlessly integrated. So now we say Ultra in Univision United, and it works out uh, very well. Uh, the most exciting thing going on with MVNOs today is uh, more of a hybrid between MVNO and OTT. I think this year we're going to start seeing the app VNO, as we like to call it, and that basically means that the MVNOs, when you sign up, you also have an app. Initially, it'll help you with customer service, APN setting, uh, paying your bill and all that, but, if, but it'll also uh, incorporate SMS, uh, potentially, um, uh, you know, different ways to get around roaming. So uh, you can be a full MVNO in the US, for example, but then when you travel overseas, you can do Wi-Fi calling um, and similar to the way OTTs operate. Uh, so I think that's really what you're gonna see. I also see a lot of, uh, a lot of OTTs uh, coming into the market. I think this year is going to be, uh, certainly going to be the year for that. Um, a, lot of, a lot of buzz here at the uh, MVNO conferences about uh, OTT. Um, it seems like everybody is coming up with, a, with an app. We have one as well. Uh, we're launching it completely separate from Ultra. It's called Primo. And it's essentially to get customers in every country other than the US. Um, I always come to the MBNO conferences. Uh, I've been to uh, Mexico, been to Dallas every year. Um, this is my first time uh, at the World Congress, and I have to say it's sensational. I really can't believe uh, the, the caliber of folks that you meet. Not only do you have the large carriers and the big, biggest MVNOs, but just we can learn best practices, we can network. Um, uh, it's run by Informa, who does a sensational job. Um, so I'm a fan, I'm a, I'm a big fan, and the fact that it uh, certainly pays for itself to come here. So I wouldn't be spending you know, a week of my time and traveling you know, 10 or 12 hours in each direction if I didn't think it was uh, really very rewarding, and, and, it, and it really is, so thank you. And I love the networking opportunities here. Um, last night on the rooftop, we were all bonding by watching a beautiful uh, sunset, which then turned into a tremendous lightning storm. Um, and afterwards, it just felt like uh, you know, there was maybe 70 or 80 people, almost all of them senior executives, and I get to pretty much meet everybody, and it's a, it's a tremendous bon vivant that's here, um, and uh, I definitely walk away with a lot of good relationships. Um, if you really want to find out what's going on in the MVNO world, understand where we are today, where we're going, it definitely makes a lot of sense to come to at least a regional conference near, near wherever you live or wherever you're operating, but definitely come to the World Congress uh, it, it's, it, it really brings it all together. Uh, tremendous learnings and uh, just great, great networking opportunities.